Right everyone, it's the 10th of December 2021. I'm going, I've come over to Cheddar the first time for three weeks because of really bad weather. Storms, um, terrible storms, Storm Barra, Storm Alwyn, um, grey skies, very fierce winds. This is still not reliable. The weather is fast moving clouds above, a wind of 18, but it's not supposed, the rain is supposed to keep off with just an odd shower. But as the day goes on, it's supposed to get better. So I'm taking a risk. I'm hoping the cows will be away when I get over the other side of the gorge later. I'm climbing up the north side of the gorge, up through the wood. Then I'll be hoping to take some nice photos of the autumn leaves on the trees on the south side, looking over to the south side. You can see all this has been knocked over. This is the recent storm we've had. But it's nearly Christmas. Hardly anyone about. No one's risking it. I'm holding on to my stick. I lost a stick over here. Left it by one of the stones on the top there. I can see men actually up on the top of the cliff doing some repair work. I'll just um, don't often see that, so I'll just zoom in. My camera's really, really playing up. Um, I've got something wrong with the viewfinder. Uh, it does come out all right, but I'm trying to look at those men up there, and it's all in different colours, like a rainbow. But I can see them. It's difficult for me to focus the camera now if it's if I'm using the viewfinder. But they're up there doing some wood walk, cutting some trees back. But as you can see, it's not quite 10 o'clock, but all the shops are shut. Um, I don't often do... I don't often do this... Um, I don't even know what this is going to turn out like. My camera is really, really playing up. It's doing some very weird things, folks. But I've got loads of videos of, of over here, so I'm not worrying too much. <laughs> so the men are right up there. People will start emerging. There's one shop open now. Cheddar cheese shop's open. Cafe's open. I'll be going back up here. Um, I don't know if this is closed up for the winter now. It looks like it, doesn't it? But somebody might still be living in there. Um, that was the old museum. It's now called Rose Cottage. Ah, so here's a familiar view, folks. That I do quite a lot, usually. Um, so, I'm going to be going to the Gorge Walk to Black Rock. So it's all uphill. I, um, I'm, I haven't decided whether I'm going to do the steep bit yet or the longer way up. I haven't decided. I'll probably do the longer way because if it does rain I might be more sheltered plus I'll be able to put my umbrella up easier. It's not really much more in it but it is a, a little bit more gentle than the steep climb up. I thought I'd do a little video. I've got no idea. I've got it on a setting I've never used before. So could, this could come out in slow motion for all I know. Right, somebody coming. So I'll just turn off for a minute. Over and out. Got my waterproofs on. Like I say, everything looks like it's in slow motion, folks. So this is a bit of an experiment with the camera today. Uh, I'll tell you why I've got it on this this shutter thing. It's because um, all the other functions are doing rapid photo shoots, which I don't want. And you want single shot. I can't find it. There's the men up there again. Let's just zoom in again. Taking their lives in their hands, look. As they do a bit of pruning and chopping. I'll try and take a picture of them as well. 
There's a lot of work going on up in the gorge. It's possible they've shut some of the gorge off today. Possible. This is, if I go up that way, that's the steep way up. But I'm not going that way. I can imagine that's going to be quite slippery and murky today. The weather, like I said, the weather is not looking good. It's supposed to be dry today. And when I first came out, it was bright blue sky. There's no clouds at all. That's how quickly it can change. But I said to Zara, if the weather changes drastically, I, would, I, would, I won't do the whole of the walk I planned. I will come back. Over and out. Right, folks. Here's the gorge on a very quiet day. We've got the um, workmen over on the, on the other side. So they won't be too happy to have people walking. We have to go further over. Um, I can see the goats from here. There's the goats. There they are, there's the rams with big horns. There he is, uh, he's beautiful isn't he? Isn't he beautiful? And you've got all the scenery here. Really gorgeous. And Glastonbury Tour straight over there. Glastonbury. I'll take some pictures of it. It's coming out quite well today. Over the last couple of months it's been shrouded in mist. I'll be able to take some photos. Right, over and out. Another short video. I'm having lots of trouble with the camera, especially doing photographs now. But here we have. I, I've missed the autumn colours because of the terrible weather. I wasn't able to get back out over this side when you saw the change from the ambers and the oranges and the greens and yellows. It's all gone wintry. That's in three weeks. I, I was un unable to get over here because the weather's been so bad. I've got no flash facility because it blew up about a year ago in my face actually. I should have uh, let Sony know about that because to be quite honest that was dangerous. I might still let them know but it's not under guarantee you see. But yeah the flash blew. It was very loud as well. It made a, it made a bang. I will let them know actually. actually I must get round to it. Anyway I thought I'd do a little video just in case the photos don't come out very well because basically they're doing fast they're doing three or five images at a time we're really fast I can't seem to find a single shot I forgot to learn where it was um, when I was at home I was supposed to sit there and try and remember find it on the menu um, that was the plan but um, what happened was um, it didn't happen. <laughs> anyway, it's lovely, isn't it? There's the gorge over there. I guess it's not coming out very well. I can't focus either, by the way. I can't focus either. Because the camera's really, really... I mean, I know they could repair them. There's only small things that probably need doing, but you just well, by the time you've done all that, you just as well buy a new camera. That's plan B for me birthday. And a Kindle. <sighs> Kindle for reading books. Or an iPad. I haven't decided which yet. I shall, that's going to be my 70th birthday present to myself. Maybe a car as well. I am being greedy now. I am being greedy. But it is lush though, those colours though, aren't they? It's dark colours. Yeah, they are lush. Over there are the fields to Piney Slights. Uh, I've got no idea. I should have got out then to see if the cows are about. But that will be another walk that I'm hoping to fit in before Christmas. To walk through Piney Slights without the cows as well. 
and just have a quick look by skirting Longwood to see what they're getting up to. It's very, it's very murky here. There's up to three couples have passed me. I give them a head start because I thought I've got to go slow. I've got slippery boots on today. These ones. They were very good when I, they're still good now. They've, it's like walking with just slippers on, but they're not waterproof and my feet will be wet by the end of the day. They're not waterproof. And, um, and I have to walk through sludge like this, you see. I've got my leggings on because otherwise my trousers will be covered in mud by the time I get to catch the bus home. I'll be plastered. So I thought to myself, put your windproofs on now. Put your windproofs on now. And um, then you, when you get to go on the bus, you can just take these off and your trousers will be clean. I've got a carrier bag to put the wet stuff in. I brought my umbrella because I don't really want to get totally soaked. Um, I'm not quite sure if the waterproof trousers I got on are my best ones, which are actually waterproof. Or... If they're my um, not so good ones, I can't remember actually. <sighs> but I'm so glad to be out. I mean, there's no fierce wind here. Look at that scene, everyone. No, there's no fierce wind. And um, it's quite mild, and they said it's getting milder, which is a good job. I've got a day out today to save on heating. Yesterday was quite nippy. And of course it's always cold if you sit at home and it's dull and grey and there's no sunshine. Um, and it's winter. I think I've only gone below 10 once. That was 9 degrees in the flat. Um, I've got over that before now. It's like an escape route that if you want to get away from the cows. It is a bit like an escape route. There's people over there. Could be people I met earlier. Could be. Right, over and out for a minute, everyone. I'm carrying on this track. I'm going towards Black Rock. Over and out.